do you think it's possible to have a, a serious, objective, rigorous political discussion with Grok? Uh, like well, for a long time and it wouldn't, like Grok 3 or Grok 4. Grok 3 is gonna be next level. I mean, what people are currently seeing with Grok is, is kind of baby Grok. <laughs> yeah, baby Grok. <laughs> it's baby Grok right now. Uh, but baby Grok's still pretty good. Um, so it's, uh, but it's an order of magnitude less sophisticated than GPT-4. And, and, and you know, it's now Grok 2, which finished training, I don't know, six weeks ago or there, thereabouts. Um, Grok 2 will be a giant improvement. And then Grok 3 will be, I don't know, order of magnitude better than Grok 2. And you're hoping for it to be like state of the art, like better than? Hopefully, I mean, this is a goal. I mean, we may fail at this goal. That is, that's the aspiration. Do you think it matters who builds the AGI? The the people and how they think and how they structure their companies and all that kind of stuff? Uh, yeah, I think it matters that there is a, I, I think it's important that that the, whatever AI wins is a maximum truth-seeking AI that is not uh, f forced to lie for political correctness. It, it, it's, well, for any reason, really. Um, political, anything. Um, I, I am concerned about AI succeeding that is, that, that has got, that is programmed to lie, even in, even in small ways. Right, because in small ways becomes big ways when it's- It become very big ways, yeah. And when it's used more and more at scale by humans. Yeah, 